Hey guys, it's Ryan here from the Bellin Fitness Center here with your Trainer Tip Tuesday. Um, I'm going to go over some kettlebell carry variations. I'm a big fan of these. Um, Christy here is going to demonstrate a couple of them. We're going to start with just a regular farmer's carry. So this is the easiest one um, out of all of the progressions here. So the weight's just down at your side. You're staying as tall as you can. And you're just walking for a certain distance, turning around and coming back. You want to get a heavy enough weight here that you can carry about 40 to 60 yards comfortably. The next one we're gonna to go to is a rack carry. So now that you're getting that weight up over your chest here, it's gonna make it a little bit harder. So Chrissy's gonna walk with this one, staying nice and tall again. Elbows are gonna be tucked in nice and tight. We don't want the shoulders to fatigue us on this one. We don't want that to be the limiting factor here. Um, if the weight gets too heavy and Chrissy can't hold it up anymore, she's just gonna regress down to that farmer's carry. She's not gonna to try to fight this weight. So you always wanna know what your regression is on these. And the next one she's gonna do, just with one kettlebell, she's gonna to go to an overhead carry. So now we're getting that, that weight as far away from the center of gravity as we can here. The weight's straight up overhead, the elbow's locked out, but we don't wanna shrug the shoulder up. We wanna pack that shoulder down. Stay nice and tall, nice and controlled. You want to be a moving statue on all of these. This is, these are exercises for stability. Um, and then again, she's going to bring that weight down. If she feels like she's fighting it too much, always know that regression. You can go down to a, a rack carry and then back down to the farmer carry. So next time you're in the fitness center, give those couple carry variations a try. And that was your Trainer Tip Tuesday.